Today I want to do a video, an unboxing of an EMP Shield product, two of them that I purchased after a bunch of storms recently. So here we go. This is what the box came in. Delivery was really fast. When you open the box, there's a sticker. There's a very um, simple how to install and then on the back it's got pictures and I do it this is for the uh, the car one then there's a thank you for purchasing and we'll blurb about them and then I also did the the whole home um, and so this one here has a little breakdown on different install options. So like I was saying in this, um, I got two. I got one, I got the vehicle one, and I got the whole home. One, the vehicle, uh, is also the generator one. So the first one on top is the whole home. So it comes, it's got your uh, the four wires, two for the breaker, two for the bus bar on the side, or the ground. I'll open this in a second. And then the next one is this. This is the vehicle one. Comes with a fuse connection and then your, um, your three different connections for ground, black, and red. This is the vehicle one. It's uh, got some good weight to it. It's got the um, very strong uh, Velcro, the rigid Velcro on it. And then it's got the uh, four screw holes on it so you can attach it. Again, like I was showing a second ago, it's got uh, probably long enough cable to do most things. And it's got your three points on here. This one is actually gonna be for our Generac standby generator to go between the battery and the computer because ours fried in this last uh, electrical storm. And this is the whole home um, out of that packaging. So you've got some leads on here that will uh, tie into your breaker panel. And then uh, on the side of it, it's got your, uh, your different ratings. It also has um, the maximum surge per phase. It's got the NEMA rating, IP rating of IP65. And then the response time is less than one nanosecond. So that's what we're wanting. And then um, on it, it's got two lights that I'll show at some point once I get a chance to get it installed. And when those two lights are on, it's on. And that's it. Uh, so these are the two that I purchased. They have a smaller one out now uh, for the vehicles. Um, but since this is gonna be for our standby generator space, really wasn't a concern. So here are these and um, I'll do another video of why I purchased these and what my plan is with these. And hopefully um, I'll try and do an install video with these going in. Thanks for watching.